J.J. McCarthy has been somewhat of a hot topic for a lot of NFL teams as we get closer to the 2024 NFL Draft. I just want it to be tomorrow. Please. Uh, this always goes so slow between mock draft season and the actual draft. It just it pains me. But this is the fun time of year, if you ask me, because we can really speculate and look at a lot of what these players did in college and kind of anticipate what they're going to do in the NFL. And this is the video where we make a case as to why the Las Vegas Raiders need to draft J.J. McCarthy. So this is a full draft profile as well. We're going to go into what he did at Michigan. So he came in as a true freshman. Uh, I believe it's kind of speculated that he was a high four uh, star as well as a five star recruit uh, when he came in in 2021. And like he wasn't awful as he came, when he came in as a true freshman, uh, threw for over 500 yards, including five touchdowns and two picks. Um, and then his two years as a starter, a uh, full-time starter, that is, he went 27-1. and one. We'll get into that in just a little bit. But uh, in his uh, two years there at Michigan, uh, 44 touchdowns uh, and nine interceptions as the full-time starter, 49-11 uh, as his career stats go along. And so, you know, there's a couple things you notice when we talk about pros. So he actually has a very good arm. Like, he has the arm to be able to fit balls into tight windows and take shots down the field. And I think I think he even has probably one of the best arms in this draft class like i truly believe he could fit some things into some tight windows and make some of the throws uh or maybe even or excuse me all of the throws that uh the quarterbacks in this draft could make he actually he has a very good arm he's also got plus side athleticism and what i mean by that is is he's not necessarily going to run every single time but if he needs to he is a threat he is a threat to run uh and you do really like his athleticism uh you also like his winning background 27 and 1 there as a uh two year starter there or excuse me uh in his two years there uh in michigan including a national championship last year uh with harbaugh and all that and you also love his locker room presence like there is really no one that has a bad or that, that has a bad thing to say about jj mccarthy like they love him in the locker room there at michigan uh as far as the cons so when i say throwing ability as the number one thing my question is is some of his touch velocity some of his touch accuracy uh on throws outside the numbers and maybe even up the seams to a degree so i do have a little bit of question of that also his big plays off uh, script playmaking ability like I, I understand that Michigan's offense was really uh, run heavy and really orientated around the play action and having him run outside of the pocket and all that stuff. So it does leave questions as to the big, the big plays he can make off scripts uh, and some of his creativity in some of those situations. Um, his playing style translation, how is that going to uh, make it into the NFL? Because he looks really good when he throws the ball over the middle. I do have a question as to him actually being able to pick defenses apart. That is definitely something that I'm going to keep an eye out for in the NFL. Also, unproven as a playmaker like i know we've really touched on it a lot here but like part of me really questions is like what is his ceiling in the nfl like what is his floor as well so i really don't know if he's a guy that can literally carry an offense but i think he's a guy that is very talented and proven in his own right that he wins and there is something to be said about that in the nfl uh if you can win and he did that in college we'll see how it translates but hey that is our reasons as to why also real quick thing here I really think that the Raiders offense, uh, he would be a really good fit for their offense based on how they run the football. He'll, he'll have playmakers. Michael Mayer, I think in year two, we'll make a video about him is going to be really something special. Plus the playmakers on the outsides and Jacoby Myers, Devonte Adams, uh, you know, also the running games, Amir White really did some good things. If Josh Jacobs is back as well, along uh, with a pretty good offensive line as well. So really the pieces are there. I think he would be a great fit for the Raiders. And I think that the Raiders need to draft JJ McCarthy, but let us know what you guys think. Make sure you guys like comment and subscribe subscribe down below all that wonderful stuff but at the end of the day let us know what you guys think about our case for as to why the Raiders need to draft Michigan quarterback JJ McCarthy